defense, but all players have to have a go-to move. Jamison, boy, as he increases his range. Tough shot, almost a beauty by Rod Monovich. As it wouldn't go down, now Gilbert Arenas to the hole. He can get there, can he? Gilbert Arenas on the attack, 7-4 Washington early. And it was touch, deflected, smart save. That was going to be Lakers basketball. You always should know where you are, obviously, and if you just look up, you'll be able to find it. He is a scoring machine. Gilbert Arenas comes into the game averaging as the Lakers pulled away in the second overtime. So it's a 6 to nothing run for the Lakers, and the Lakers have the lead. Not for long, though. <laughs> Gilbert Arenas puts him back up. Gilbert Arenas, how strong is he? Man, it's not a matter how strong he is, it's how good is he. <laughs> he is He is good. He's so dangerous. See the double team, now that frees up people. Arenas puts it inside for the open man. Don't and they didn't recover him. to Antoine Jameson from a first round pick that played for the Warriors. And turns him from the outside. So he got the board, he got the bucket, and quickly, Jameson into double figures with 10. They only have two guys that have scored. Jameson's got 10 and Arenas has eight. But that's not unusual. I mean, they got two others that are just chomping at the bit. Lottie, four of seven for the field with a couple of three points. And once again, on the attack, the Wizards. This time, the three scores, while all five starters for the Lakers have scored. Off the dribble, Gilbert Arenas rattles it home. It is a three-pointer. Final shot coming up for the Lakers. Jordan Farmar. Going to shoot it, Lottie. It's going to be real short. As Gilbert Arenas was right in his chest. On the crossover, the reach on Smush. And technical foul on Brian Cook. Yep, once again. Offense up, offense. Gilbert Arenas. It'll be a reach. Because if Jalenson's not there, there's nothing he can do with that one. Arenas setting up, but what a catch by Haywood. <laughs> It'll be Stevenson from Arenas. And if they get other sources, guys like Deshaun Stevenson, who averages 8-9 a game. Gilbert, I talked about being a gunner. He gets inside and slices it home with a little English. Really played into their hands, didn't really push the issue. Yo, but Arenas doesn't need much space, does he? Boy, what a release. Doesn't, have, doesn't need any space. Ron Butler weaving his way to the rack. And got underneath Kwame. Boy, that was patience. He didn't rush it, did he? So you get a whistle. Yo, but Arenas, and Bynum blocked it away. He can't believe it. Well, if you can take it that deep, so can I. But he didn't go with it. Farmar holds him up, and he's got free throws. Stop letting you hear about it. So it stays a seven-point lead. Gilbert Arenas with space. Bonovich almost gets it away. He's made his last six. Boy. Arenas now. Gilbert Arenas has had problems on the road this year. Might have kept it alive, but it's tapped away. Two teammates really did take it away. Opposite end. Guess who? Gilbert Arenas up to 34. Arenas. And it's closed, but it made no difference. Arenas could seriously get up there. And he was falling away anyway, so 19th and field goal percentage defense. On the pick and roll, Arenas to the hole, and he'll go to the line to shoot two. I mean, he has absolutely put it up and put it in against the Lakers. In 37 minutes, he's got 38 points. And it doesn't matter where he's shooting it and who's in front of him. Crowd is alive at Staples Center. 110-104. Arena's trying to get to the hole. And he's got a couple of Brendan Haywood caught in the air, found Gilbert Arenas, and he'll go to the line as Kobe got him on the way by, they say. And an opportunity for a three-point play as Arenas is up to 41 points. That was some shot by Gilbert. Inside of four to play. Most important thing for now the Lakers. And good luck for Karan Butler. It's back to a dozen. So they got it down, as I said. So Radmanovich gets him on the way by. 124-120. Now can you get the steal? Arena splits the double. No foul. Yeah. That's a long, that's just a long time. It starts with Mo Evans' pressure on the ball. It goes to Gilbert Arenas. Who else? Four seconds to play. Will we go to overtime? Arenas, the jumper over Kobe. And we go to overtime. The Lakers will take it. After trailing by as many as 17 for the second time this weekend, it is an X. Now they come out quickly, and Gilbert Arenas grab, he'll go to the line, shoots two. A break for the Lakers. Lakers' first lead since the opening 12 minutes of play. And again, I told you, it didn't last long the last time, did it? What was it, 10-9? <laughs> yes. Trying to get inside, and he'll go to the line to shoot two more. 
didn't go for it. And Luke gambling, and it's a foul. Don't isolate like this. There he goes. Radmanovic tries to get there, but it's too late. The one point lead. There goes Arenas, and he's got a three-point opportunity. Andrew Bynum came over late. He created the contact. Smart play. Back to a three-point lead, and Gilbert Arenas can make it a two-possession game with a minute. Running a lead. It's Arenas for three. Boy, what a night for Gilbert. That's Gilbert Arenas to 58 points. So that's a franchise record. He has topped the total of Earl Monroe. Jumps it across. Good look for Radmanovic. That might do it. That, that this will do it. Karan Butler, nobody back for the Lakers. We'll slam it home. Well, see, they were in a foul situation even if they make a three, so. Got a foul, and he does. And there's 60. Kwame coming back in the game for rebounding purposes. What rebound? The late year champion. He got it. He's got 60. Farmar at the buzzer. And it's over. In overtime, it's a six-point win on a career night for the Washington Wizards, L.A. native Gilbert Arenas. Uh, Gilbert Arenas put on quite a show and then gave a couple of bows just now to the front row people who were giving him a little bit of <laughs> razzy during the game. He says, how do you like me now?